I'm Brian Abel. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. The violent riots in Washington, D.C. this past week has triggered a debate about allowing open carry guns at the state capitol in Lansing. The topic, the only thing on the agenda of a special meeting suddenly called by the Capitol Commission for Monday afternoon. Some lawmakers have been calling for a ban since armed protester, protesters entered the building last spring. Michigan State Police are investigating an early morning crash that injured seven teenagers in Otsego County. Troopers say the 17-year-old driver was heading south on old M27 near Otsego Lake Drive when their truck left the roadway and went airborne before rolling over an embankment. Seven teenagers between the ages of 17 and 19 were inside the vehicle. Two of them taken to the hospital. Troopers say speed did play a role in the crash. Starting tomorrow, the state will enter into the next phase of COVID-19 vaccinations. Adults 65 and older will now be eligible in this new phase, along with teachers and city and state employees. However, there is a concern over a limited supply of doses. Governor Whitmer says the state only gets about 60,000 vaccines a week from Pfizer, while Moderna ships directly to CVS and Walgreens locations. And today, parents in Highland Township were out showing support for schools reopening for face-to-face -face learning. Governor Gretchen Whitmer is encouraging districts to begin offering in-person instruction again by March 1st. These parents from Huron Valley School say the move is a step in the right direction. They are hoping their voices will be heard when it comes to the future decisions regarding education. Let's go check our forecast now with Mike Taylor. Mike. Hey, thanks, Brian. The clouds are slowly going to filter back into Metro Detroit. So for the rest of this evening, we may be partly cloudy right now, but the clouds will take over. But that will keep us from cooling off at least too much. Uh, going with 25 in Detroit from Mount Clemens as well. And that's the head out towards the west, Howell and Ann Arbor. No teens this time around. Your lows will be in the low 20s.